Hi, Hugo Reed. The second book we're going to read today is nonfiction, and it's Tigers. Big Beast series. The author is Stephanie Turnbull. This is one of the books that came from the Turkey Trot when you guys raised money for that. Okay. Tigers are huge. What a pretty picture. It's also giving us a table of contents here on the first page. So we know what else is coming up in the book. Giant cats. Tigers are the biggest wild cats in the world. They live in Asia. Bengal tigers live in hot grassy lands. A few Bengal tigers have white fur. Have you ever seen one of those somewhere? Those are pretty amazing when they're all white like that. Siberian tigers live in cold forests. Their thick fur keeps them warm. You would have to have thick fur to be in that all the time, wouldn't you? Stay away. What tigers like best is lots of space to roam alone. They fight any other tiger who comes near. They love to cool off in the water. That's interesting, isn't it? Because we don't, we think of like our pet cats usually don't like to be in the water at all. So it's interesting that tigers like to swim. On the prowl. As the sun sets, tigers pad silently along, searching for dinner. Tigers have amazing eyesight. They can see well in the dark. Their ears perk up to catch every sound. Look at those eyes. Sneaky hunting. When tigers spot a deer or antelope, they crouch low in the grass. Their stripes help them hide. Slowly they creep forward, closer and closer, and then spring. It's getting ready to spring up and catch what it's, gonna, what it's hunting for. Attack! Tigers pounce on their prey and drag it to the ground in a flash. They kill the animal with one big bite. They can eat a whole animal in one meal. Wow, can you imagine if we ate a whole animal in one meal? That would be a lot. Killer claws. Wow, can you see those? That's amazing. Tigers have long, razor-sharp claws that pop out when they're ready to attack. They have five claws on each front paw and four on each back paw. Tigers scratch tree trunks to keep their claws clean and sharp. You want your claws sharp so you can really grab whatever you're hunting for fast, wouldn't you? Ooh, look at those pictures. Look at those teeth. No wonder they can grab other animals. Open wide, it says, tigers have 30 terrifying teeth. The four front long, I'm sorry, the four long front teeth are for biting. Each one is longer than your finger. That's a long tooth. The other front teeth are for tearing meat. Wide back teeth can slice chunks of flesh. So when you're an animal, you have to have teeth that'll do just what you need them to do. You don't have silverware to cut things up for you, right? So your teeth have to be the tools that do all that work. Big babies. Tiger babies are called, I bet you know this, cubs. At first, they snuggle in a cozy den, drinking their mother's milk. Bigger cubs like having play fights. They learn to hunt and look after themselves. So by learning to play fight, that's how they're learning what they need to know when they're older. Tiger talk. Tigers purr to say, I'm happy, or I like you. Angry growls mean go away or I'll attack. A roar means 
Here I am, don't come near me. Remember it said they like to be alone, right? Fun facts. Big facts. Tigers can be as long as you and two friends lying end to end. So, three, of your, three people, three children laying end to end. A tiger could be that long. That's a big, big cat. Can you imagine? Think of that if it was lying, like compared to like your bed, that's like bigger than your bed. So that would be a really long cat. Or think how long that is compared to your car. So not all tigers would be that long, that big. Till the, you know, that would be some of the biggest ones, but still that's big. The biggest, ti the biggest tigers weigh the same as 100 pet cats. So if you took a scale on one side put a tiger and on the other side you'd have to put 100 cats to make it go even, to be the same. Tigers can attack animals as big as crocodiles and bears and young elephants. So those are pretty big things that they could get. A big tiger paw is the size of this page, which I have pretty big hands and that's way bigger than my hand. So that would be very helpful with them hunting, wouldn't it? And that's the end of the book. It has useful words at the end. A den is a tiger's sleeping place. Tigers make dens in caves, in hollow trees, and in thick grass. Pounce. To jump or spring on something suddenly to try to catch it. You could pounce on something. Prey. P-R-E-Y. The animal that is hunted by another animal. So there's the predator and the prey. They would be the predators. And the things they're hunting are the prey. I hope you have a great rest of the day. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.